thousand years later. Everything chrome. Everything is chrome in the future. <laughs> oh my. Impossible. He's lying. future? Welcome to the future, history person. During your absence, our society has achieved numerous advances. We're sure you will find to be quite impressive. Well? Drinking fountains for short people! What will the future think of next? We now return to tonight's creepy time theater mm. presentation of Night of the Robot. <laughs> <laughs> Hurry, Gary! The scary robot movie's on! Hold on tight! Gee, Sandy, this sure feels so. <laughs> <laughs> As sure as I'm a doctor professor. Patrick, don't you think we should test it? Okay. That's not exactly what I had in mind. Your bedroom on your right. Oh, I say. This is splendid. Oh, absolutely splendid. What's this? Oh, marvelous. This machine is evacuating my nostrils of unwanted breath of you in a manner most pleasant. Good work, Mr. Dr. Professor Patrick. Good gracious. Can it be? Try it again. <laughs> I see, huh, darling? Oh, can it, computer wife? Can't you see I'm exhausted? Why don't you go make yourself useful and synthesize me up some grub? Yes, your majesty. What do we got here? Oh, goody. 
Aha! Well, I hate to leave you, Karen, but you know what they say, a rolling stone gathers no algae. Race for the afterburners! You can't bring regular food into space. Why not? Because as we leave Earth's gravity, everything becomes weightless, and any uncontained food will float off in all directions. Oh. Is that a problem? Only if it gets sucked into the reverse spatial linearity drive. Ah, nuts! Oops! That looks like a good spot. SpongeBob, now that we've got our camp set up, it's time for some moon crater boarding. What's moon crater boarding? It's simple. You ride these on that like this. Yee-haw! Right here's the flippity doodah. And right there's the classic Texas tail grab. And this I call the 720 nut job. Munchy! And let's not forget my grandpappy's favorite, the Tour of the Saturn! Stargazer! Understand about more. Another bag of chum. Ugh. Now to shape this into His Highness's dinner request. <laughs> the whole package. I can't believe this. After all I've done for you, you dumped me for this cheap pile of plastic? Well, I had to cut costs somewhere. Who are you calling cheap? At least I don't rust. And why did I outfit her with a molecular rearranger ray? Here's your stir fry, little. Oh. Shelby Nautica, huh? What a beautiful name. Thank you. My leg. My leg! My leg! Crash! 
trash. <laughs> trash. Three thousand years later. To this day, no one knows why these mysterious statues were created or by whom. Gary, 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 Gary! What now, Mr. Krabs? That's right, I am Krabs. Your boss, your ruler, your master! <laughs> ha, ha, ha. Nonsense, I'm the fastest computer alive. Ha, ha, ha. Journey to the center of Karen! <laughs> Ow! It looks like the virus is heading to Karen's memory banks. Intruder detected. My name? Where is this delivery to? Mars. Oh, Mars. Well, the... No, 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 Mars! Bye, Squidward! <laughs> delivery from the Krusty Krab. <laughs> I am Robo 2.1, your personal robot servant. I am proficient in providing over 250,000 creature comforts. Would you care for a pastry? Agent of naughtiness, go and destroy SpongeBob's good name! <laughs> huh? Oh, yeah. I am ready. I am ready. I am ready. Ready to destroy Christmas! Hurry up, Santa! Hop on! It's a portal to other worlds. I built it to explore the universe. Also for quick trips to Texas to pick up some of my favorite barbecue nuts. Dad Nabbit, that ding dang nut stealing army back again! Turn 